Hey, good morning, everyone. Happy day. How are you guys doing? Yes, I'm back. Um, so I'm adding back some exercises. My cycling uh, challenge is over. I am still cycling, of course. But what I want you guys to do is to join me for the next six weeks to get really serious and deep into working out and nutrition. So I am prepping for the next six weeks for a photo shoot um, and also a completion of a four month challenge that I've been undergoing. And the end date is September 12th. So that's the week that it ends. And so I'm prepping. So that's why I'm getting back into my working out every day except for Wednesday because I'm be climbing hills in the morning and also cleansing on Mondays and just cleaning up my nutrition. So if you want to join me, message me and I will get you set up with everything that you need to get yourself started on a healthy routine for the next six weeks and beyond of course because like it's not just about six weeks it's about now and forever I hate to say it people don't like hearing it but that's the truth it's now and forever and if you like I'm gonna be turning 50 in January and it was my mission this year to get my body in the best shape ever I'm not done and of course you guys know that I'm doing that challenge so things are you know just heating up for that but I have to finish what I started and I'm looking for a couple people who want to join me and so message me personally if you want to be one of those five people I'm gonna take like five um, and if there's more that's great but it's gonna involve working out it's gonna involve working together and also a specific nutritional system that I work with because I know it works and I'm using it and if you want solid results then that's just something that I totally recommend all right so are you ready for today we got our Tabata timer um, we are going to be into our bands again so really focusing on the booty and also don't forget to have your water. So make sure you got your arena strength bands. I will add the link above later if you haven't gotten them. Oh my gosh, get them. They have been one of the main um, pieces of equipment I've been using for the last almost year. Um, and uh, they're just amazing. All right. So. Whew. All right, let's start with our 90 seconds of warm up. We've got our Tabata timer here. So what we'll be doing, if you're just joining me for the first time, we warm up for 90 seconds. Then we get into three workouts for legs, three workouts for arms and abs. And each one of them is 50 seconds on 10 second rest. And um, some of the legs we have doubles. So which will mean that we are going to, our workout is going to be 30, about 33 minutes with instruction. So it will be longer because I'll be walking you through um, the different exercises, how to do them properly, right? That's the most important thing. And woo, let's get started. Oh, we need some music. We need some volume here. All right, so whatever you're going to do, let's warm up the muscles, the ligaments, or joints. You can do jumping jacks. You can do side to side. Just warming everything up because what we're starting with is our legs. If you don't want to jump, make sure you're doing something. You got skipping rope. All 
Good, breathe it out, 40 seconds. All right, let's open up those arms. I like these. Just have to make sure I go to the bathroom beforehand. <laughs> you know what I mean, ladies. Boom. Good. Ten seconds. All right. So the point is to elevate our heart rate and warm up our joints so they're feeling warm. And so this is what we're going to be doing for our first group of leg workouts. So we're going to grab our arena strength bands. So you're going to be, want your pink. So this is the easy one. This is the mid-range one. These are the two we're going to be using today. Uh, we're going to start with this one. And then since we've got three rounds, we're going to bring out the last one for our last set. Okay. So, bear stance. So this is a right and left. So you'll be like this, and we're gonna fire hydrate it out. Okay. So we're gonna stay in this plank position. So your abs are super tight, and we're gonna do a right and left. Then the next one is we do side lying. You bring your leg out, pulse up down, pulse up. So front, up, keep that leg, this body nice and straight, up and side, up and side. Okay, so that's a right and left. And then number three is going to be a squat. Walk, shuffle, however you want, the lower the better. Engaging those glutes, bringing the abs in, and that's our three leg workouts. So we got 50 seconds each. It's going to be a total of 15 minutes because we've got basically five times three. And so let's go. All right. So let's get into our first one, and out, and breathe. So remember, 50 seconds. You can take your rest when you need. Remember, we're doing this three times, okay? And Keep it down. Keep those abs tight. Oh. Whoa. And let's go. Seven. Oh. Let's finish it up. Oh. All right. So we got 10 seconds. So I hope you're on the floor doing this too. Bringing that, building those booty, booty up and Good. Oh. 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 Okay. I don't know if it's like maybe the 150 kilometers I biked this weekend, but this is a struggle. Let's go seven. Hi! That's why it's nice to start with the lighter band. Okay, so we're going to start with out and up, two, 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 and two, 
two, and two, out. <laughs> oh my word. Yeah, I'm gonna struggle through these just right alongside you. And out. Keep that toe pointed. We work on legs. Up. Good. Oh. Fourteen. Let's do this. Next one is our squats. So nice and low, and we're gonna shuffle. Side to side. Good. Candy. Oh yeah. Got a, a little visitor from our friend. You'll see her in the picture. Oh, 50. Come on. Let's finish up round one. Since our electrolytes. All right, ready? Oh, oh yeah, bear stance. That's why, that's why I was thinking it was a little easier. So, you can obviously go down onto all fours. If you're just starting, or if you want to finish, Okay, into round two. Whew. Feel them get like building that muscle. Try and keep your head up. Abs nice and tight. Sixteen. Woo. Let's do this. All right. Okay, side, abduction, so point, let's go front, one, two, one, two. Oh my god, right side, Ooh. 
this muscle right there. Breathe. Ten. Let's do this couple more. really don't need the band for any of these. So I can do them without equipment. Well, these ones anyways. Um, the arms and arms you will need the bands. Forward. those abs pressing up up oh my gosh okay let's get that shuffle in for our round three so try and get good and deep work on it. Those glutes. Boom. Nice and wide and out. Keep it low and shuffle. Shake it up. Round three. Let's do this, friends. Oh yeah, I did say. So round three. Let's just make it that much harder. And oh yeah. It's <laughs> like make it harder by 150%. Good. Oh my gosh. You know, it's minimal movement, but 100% different. Oh, five. Let's do this. And other side. All right, up on those toes and out. We keep going. Remember, we've got 50 seconds. Take your little breaks. You can go down on the on your hands and knees. all that in the background was the cat. The cat. Hey, Lily. Abs tight. You got 14 seconds. Keep going. Oh, oh my gosh. All right. Are you guys ready for this? I don't know if I'm ready for this. All right. Side. And side. Up. No. Keep it 
going. <laughs> oh my gosh. I want to cry. Side, front, side. Bring it forward. That's side. Five. Okay, this will only make it look a lot easier. Obviously in the videos, I'm here to tell you that it's not, especially with this pink band. Last legs. Oh. Okay, shuffle. Let's keep it low and walk it out. Walk it. Oh my word. Ooh. Can you feel the, the glutes just like super hard? Let's keep those legs straight. Good. Keep it going. We got 14 seconds left. All right. Oh, okay. Awesome work. We finished our legs. Now we're going to move on to our arms. And I'm going to take you over to the door here because that's where, okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to start with, um, a front press. Okay. So I have, this is what I have. It's just a cable. It's knotted. It's basically a circle, but if you have um, any kind of a rope at home, all you have to do is knot it to put in to the door, and then you have your loop, and then you have a carabiner, okay? Now, you don't really need the carabiner for these ones, uh, the first two, because you can basically loop it around here. So just loop it around right here. And we want to have this high. So actually kind of around shoulder level, a little bit lower. So there you go. Now, we're going to turn around and it's going to be like a chest press. So make sure it's a lot even and we're out. So what's nice is that you can step forward a little bit more to make it harder. You want to engage the abs, tighten the glutes to hold yourself in place and your press. Okay. So that is the first one. Then you're going to have to uh, change it up. Actually, I'm going to take my gray one. So these are the body bands and you have the label here. So it's square, it kind of latches like right into the door. So if I can get these two in here at the same time, then we won't have to, probably not. I'm just gonna knot this around the door. This one, I'm going to go from the floor. Right here, so I'm going to walk it in. 
place. Okay. And that wasn't right. Because <laughs> it's a bicep curl. So we're definitely going to have to move this around. Okay. So I'm just going to take this off here. I'm going to knot this and I'm gonna, we're going to be moving it. And this one is a bicep curl. So from the floor. Ooh, and that's what you don't want happening. Ow. So always make sure you lock your door. the door if you got a door like this. So you got your bicep curls right here. Okay. And then you're going to keep it down there and you're going to lock it into your carabiner and you're going to bring it, your bed up. Okay. So upward press. Okay. So that's the three. <laughs> this up really Ow. All right. So those are the three arm exercises that we're going to be doing. Um, so let's go back. So we will have to switch things around. There's not a problem. So we'll start up here. Wait, remember, lock it in so the door does not swing open. And we're going to switch it up for our chest press. So remember, you have your different band options. And with even the body bands, um, you can almost use all three of them. Oh my god, that really like got me right underneath the sternum. Okay. So we're going to do our front press. Get ready. Stepping forward and pressing out. Good. So you can get your elbows in between the bands or bring it over your shoulder. Hold and out. Good. Boom. Hold and out. So remember, engaging your abs, engaging your glutes, holding yourself there. Get your legs in position. Good. And press. And out. And press. All right. Now we're going to move to our bicep curls. So we're going to have to switch it up, bring it down to the bottom, lock it. And... Gonna bring them up. So you can bring your elbows out a little bit. And so the pink one is just perfect. You want to lean in, hold, and down. Hold and down. Hold and down. I love about bands is that you can make them so much harder so we can tempo and down. Okay, so now we're switching it up. You got your carabiner and you're going to make it one band like this and we're going to be pressing up like this. So kind of like a front raise. Good. Excellent. So the nice thing is that you can use, change your resistances in your bands. You can start with a gray and third round, move it to the pink. So it's hold and tempo down. One, two, three. One, two, three, up. One, two, three, down. One, two, three, up. Good. Nice work for the shoulders. 
up and remember glutes and abs are always engaged Whew. so that's our round for our arms let's go into round two so back those pectoral muscles. Boom. Good. Get a little definition to our chest. Mine's been like that for decades. It's hereditary. Absolutely no fat here. Ever, ever, ever in my life. bicep curls. So glutes engage, abs engage. We're not going to keep our arms in like this. We're going to extend them out a little bit and lock and down and down. Hold and down. So let's tempo it, make it a little bit harder. One, two, three, hold. One, two, three, down. One, two, three, hold. One, two, three, down. Hold. Hold. One, two, three, down. Thirteen. Good. All right. So switching it up. Now let's go. Raise and down. So let's tempo this as well. So glutes are engaged, abs are engaged. One, two, three. 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 Nice and wide. Awesome! Round two done. Let's move it up. Stand here, you're pressing your chest in and your abs, and you got your glutes engaged. A very active little kitty this morning. Keep those elbows up and back. And back. Awesome. Okay, let's move it down to the bottom for the last round. Remember, we're going to tempo this, so glutes engaged, abs tight, one, two, three, so elbows out a little bit, and glued, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three. Thank <laughs> you. 
six. Couple extra for the left arm. All right. Okay. Ready? Glutes engaged, abs, and up. One, two, three, down. Shoulders. Good. Let's go ten. Last one. Let's hold. All right. Let's hold that. Is it a big red mark? Okay, so we're gonna crank it down. And we're gonna get into our abs. Just bring it down to the floor. Okay. All right. So do you guys like to see the timer? You guys don't want to see the timer, do you? I'll put it here. Just okay. okay. I never show the timer. Sometimes it's just like quit too early. All right, so we're gonna start with the gray. And we're gonna lean back. What we're gonna do is we're gonna press out and down. Okay, so really tighten up and touch down. So super slow and down. And down. So this is the last nine minutes. So here's your 10 minutes of abs. Now we're going to do a slow press out. So from here, you're going to press it out and up. Out and up. up. So remember, keep the legs a little bit apart because you need to keep the band nice and tight and down. Okay? So super micro movements and the last one here is we're going to be in a crunch and we're going to bring the legs out okay so we're going to crunch up and out down up and up down up and out okay so that's our abdominal workout you guys ready you guys don't need to see this really i need to see that Okay, let's go. So, this up and out. Is that what I did before? Probably not. Anyways, this one seems better. And press out. I know this is totally different, but this is what we're going to do. So you can put this at your your ankles. Um, or not at all. Alright, so up as press. So keep those legs a little bit apart so you keep the band nice and tight and really tighten those abs here. Good. Press down nice and slow. Good. And 
eight, seventeen. think for around two and three, I'm going to add the pink one. All right. So, oh. Good. Press. Maybe I can change this one too. So keep that back super flat to the floor. Switch this one up to the pink. Oh my god. That's like out. Oh. Woo. That's just made it 150% harder. In. Out. And breathe. Next one, legs up and open a little bit and touch. One, two, good job everybody. Touch down, keep them wide so the abs are super engaged and slightly touch, point those toes. Keep it going, everybody. Press it out. Press. Press. Oh my God. Five. All right, round three, and now we're gonna be done. Okay, last three minutes. In, out.
to give a nice and tight out and touch down. Good. And press those like knees out and touch. And press down. So keep the band nice and tight. Okay. All right, friends. This is the last one. Keep that back nice and pressed tight. Oi, fourteen. All right. Woof. Way to go, everybody. Hope you felt that right in those abs. Look at that. Work in those. You have to work them multiple times a week to get them. Plus, nutrition plays 80%. So let's just do a quick stretch out. I haven't stretched in a couple days. Do those legs. Because this is definitely from the 150k on the weekend. And up. Let's do the other side. Alright, so we're continuing our stretching. We're going to put this aside. And we're going to go into table. Put our bands over here. Also, vacuum in. Really pull from the lower abdominal area. And out. Go up, punch down the dog. Good. Let's crouch it. And up. Right into cobra. Let's go down. Child's pose. All right, last one for all those cyclists and runners and everyone who's been working really hard at your desk. Let's get into stretching out our calves, Achilles, and hamstrings. 
right here, up to press those toes, bring those toes down, and press, down, and press, over, good, so if you're not here, slowly press them out, and work, and stretch. So that flexibility is super, super important. All right, guys, with that, have an amazing day. High five, high 10, and I will see you back here for another awesome workout. Take care, bye. Oh, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Go to my YouTube channel. All of these are uploaded. Subscribe there, hit the bell, and you won't miss a live workout if you're looking for one. Take care.